the pending bills are, are, are historical, and they, to have a pending bill is where the supplier says they are supplying some goods, and then when it is processed for payment, it is turned down for one reason or the other. One, it could lack maybe the contract, maybe if the contract is not very well documented, it could also lack the inspection certificate. Therefore, for you to be paid as a supplier, you must comply and attach all the supporting documents for you to, to qualify. Therefore, since 2013, there are many suppliers for National Youth Service who are not able to attach all the relevant documents that makes a payment voucher qualify for payment. Those are what we are calling payment, uh, pending bills. Normally what the government would do with the pending bills, they would isolate them, maybe establish a committee within Treasury that would look to what extent are we, uh, can they supply, those who have not supplied and the, the, those documents, and they still have them somewhere, if they bring and the document is complete, they can be paid. There are those others, maybe when scrutinized, the pending bill committee will be able to say this one cannot be paid. And I think then the supplier, if it's still aggrieved and doesn't feel I've been treated fairly, they can go to court.